Just think about the time when your mom came to you, she brought you so close to her, and she told you how much she loves you. Think about the time when your father gave you a pet on your back and told you that he loves you. How good did it feel? How happy were you? Now imagine the creator of the heavens and the earth, the one who is more merciful to you than your own mother, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala, my creator and your creator, saying that he loves you. قُلْ إِن كُنْتُمْ تُحِبُّونَ اللَّهَ فَاتَّبِعُونِي يُحْبِبْكُمُ اللَّهَ يُحْبِبْكُمُ اللَّهُ وَيَغْفِرْ لَكُمْ ذُنُوبَكُمْ وَاللَّهُ غَفُورٌ رَّحِيمٌ Attaining the love of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is the status for which the righteous and the true believers compete and strive for. The love of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is the nourishment for the heart and the soul. The love of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is a delight for the eyes. The love of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala is what makes us strong. In the authentic hadith, the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa alihi wa sallam said, that when Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala loves his servant, he calls out to Jibreel and tells him, inni uhibbu fulanan fa Oh Jibreel, I love so and so, so love him. And then Jibreel loves him. After that, Jibreel alayhi salam announces to the inhabitants of the heavens, Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala loves so and so, so love that person. And then they love him as well. And then Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala will put Kabul in people's heart for that person on earth. Brothers and sisters, if you want to attain that high status of Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala loving you, first and foremost, do that which Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala made obligatory upon us. The five daily prayers, the zakat, the hajj, for the one who is able to, fasting, that will bring you close to your creator. And then to attain his love, follow the sunnah of the Prophet sallallahu alayhi wa alihi wa sallam in your ibadah, pray the nawafil, Fast Mondays and Thursdays, read the Quran and reflect upon its meaning. Follow the Sunnah in your actions, in your words. Follow the Sunnah in your appearance, in your manners. Follow the Sunnah in every way possible.